October marks 15 years for First Works, an organization working to connect arts to the audience. And to celebrate, they're doing it big, bringing Palabalus to Providence. Here to tell us more about this big show is Kathleen Pletcher, Executive Artistic Director of First Works, and Isabel Tadmori, Director of Development over at First Works. Good morning, ladies. Good morning. morning. Great to be here. Thanks for being here. Congratulations, by the way. 15 years. Thank you. It's amazing. It's, it's amazing to mark that time of mm -hmm. bringing First in the arts to Providence and to Rhode Island and also to students across the state and yeah. we're really excited to launch on October 26th our artistic icon series with Palabolus mm -hmm. who are movement illusionists who are, are near and dear to our heart we have a long relationship and Isabel what does that mean a movement illusionist what type of show is this it's a very athletic show there's a lot of dancing there's movement there's acrobatics it's something for everyone really mm -hmm. <laughs> The people are extremely talented. I mean, you look at them, you look at their bodies, and yeah. what they're perfectly capable of, the flexibility, the strength. It You're really, going to be in awe. Yeah, really high voltage. Their name, Palabolus, came from a, a fun-loving fungus. So there's also <laughs> okay. hilarity in this. They've mm -hmm. collaborated with OK Go, video and visual and music and beauty. Yeah. Um, so it's it's an amazing combination. And people mm -hmm. may have seen Palabolus in a few different ways. They were the first artists that started our first season in 2004. They've wow. been on the Oscars, performed at the Olympics, and last wow. summer we brought them as part of PVD Amazing. Fest with their Umbrellas project. Wow. So, so, yeah, so they are kind of familiar faces, and we're seeing some, just some of what they are, are capable of right here. Isabel, how, how else are you guys celebrating this 15-year anniversary? It's such a remarkable um, milestone. It certainly is. Uh, one of the things that is core to our program is an education program. So mm -hmm. all the artists that come as part of our season are required to interact with our students and we have almost 4,000 students in our program annually. Wow. So we will have about a thousand students at a student matinee on Friday at the Vets. And so they'll see a portion of the performance with Palabolas, but they'll mm -hmm. also get to interact with the artists and that's what's really key about this program yeah and I love that about first works no matter who you're bringing in I mean you want to maybe inspire that next generation of artists in their work absolutely so the mission is connecting art with audiences mm -hmm. and and the public performance is the most visible piece um, we bring some of our festival experience into the theater with performances in the lobby and also special receptions and social events that that mm -hmm. um, people and some of our donors can get to know the artists in a backstage kind of way. Yeah, First Work Show was kind of unlike any other in the best way possible. Sure. Isabel, how, how do we get tickets for something like this? I know you mentioned like the student matinee show. Are, are there, I'm assuming there are other showings. Exactly. The evening performance is at 8 p.m. on okay. Friday, the 26th of October. Tickets are available through the Vets box office, but also through our website, first-works.org. Okay. Perfect. So plenty of opportunities to see that Palabolus. I know, now we know a little bit about the name and we just saw what they can do. So I'm intrigued. And it's just the start of a whole season of music and mm. hip hop and dance Ooh, yeah. and puppetry, um, bringing Heather Henson, the daughter of Jim Henson, founder Huge of the name. Muppets. Yeah, That's with great, a, a big spectacle to yeah. start 2019. Well, we're happy and congratulations again on 15 years. Ladies, thank you, thank you so much for joining us. It's going to be a great performance. We're not going to want to miss that. If you want information, information or tickets to the show to learn how you can purchase those over at FirstWorks, visit us at broadshow.com.